Hello, I wanted to hop on real quick because I have a problem with my printer and I love my printer. It is an ink tank by Epson. It's the 2750. This printer is a workhorse. Um, I've had it for over a year and my ink levels, I'll just show you, are not even half empty. Um, I'd say maybe a third and that's pushing it because I don't think they're quite at a third, but they're getting there. Um, but it's an Epson ink tank 2750. And I love this. I use my printer a lot. I print for my daughter's Girl Scout troop, for my kids. I'm a scrapbooker, so I print a lot of journaling out, journaling cards, scrapbook elements, tons of photos. Um, today I'm working on our Christmas cards, and the only thing that I have been unhappy with this printer about in the past is that when I got thick, thick card stock, or every year I try to get our photos, um, or photo cards done for Christmas, so they're these, and I get them from Photo Affections, and usually they run some great Groupon deals. Go check that out because they have really great prices for Christmas cards. They are a really nice print quality. They're if you get the matte, they're on this really great thick, heavy, smooth cardstock paper, and they just have this teeny tiny Photo Affections emblem on the bottom. So I just cover that up with a piece of washi tape, and then I print our Christmas letter right on the back and send these puppies out so I don't pray for any of the sh the like premium upgrades or anything like that. I just do it myself. And because I have this eco tank, um, I can print a ton and I'm not using a lot of ink. I'm not replacing the ink. And when I do run out of ink, the ink is super cost effective to replace. You just dump it back in the printer and off you go. I've been really happy with the quality of it. Um, I print photos on it all the time. Really, I could have printed these cards for myself and they would have turned out just like that. Um, this printer prints fantastic. Um, but I'm working on my Christmas cards and I notice when I send these Christmas cards through or anytime I have heavy duty card stock, the printer kind of makes this awful noise and it just spits the card back at me. It does not like how thick it is. So I couldn't find any videos anywhere to fix this and I decided that I would get on here, do a quick video. I hope it's not too dark. I don't have great lighting in here, but um, and show you how to fix this problem with your printer because it's a non-existent problem once you know this trick. So you go ahead and go to file, go to prints like you normally would, and then you're going to go into your pretty printing properties over here. And when you get to printing properties, you're going to go and click on, there's three little tabs up here that say main, more options, and maintenance. Click on the maintenance tab. And then go down and click on right here where it says, I don't know if you can see that, extended settings. So I'm going to click there. And then I get all these bars and graphs and it tells you um, about the offset. And then it goes down to this area here. It's all about print density. Okay, the default is for this to be set at zero. If you want to print thick papers, you take it from the zero and you're going to slide it over. And I recommend putting it on about a five. Okay, and then that is all you have to do. Then hit OK. Go in. You're going to just hit OK, get out of that screen, print your paper, and it will magically shoot out of your Epson ink tank printer. And you will not have problems with it printing thick things anymore. When you're done printing on thick cardstock, simple as it was before, just go in to printer properties, go up to maintenance again, and go down here again to extended settings. And turn this back to a zero, and you'll be right back where you were. If you want to make it even easier, just hit reset defaults, and it'll take it back to a zero for you. Click OK, OK, and then you're right back to printing on regular paper like you want. All right, since I couldn't find a video, I made you one. I hope this helps somebody um, so they don't have to go searching all over the internet and creation to find this out. But anyways, happy printing, and I really, really recommend this printer. Ink Tank 2750 by Epson. It is the best. All right. Thanks, everybody.